Okie dokie. Hello, Ding Dong. The Wicked Witch is dead. This is the wireless doorbell with a button that I'm gonna be using right here. And here is the barcode if you're interested in that. I'll link one or this same one inside the description below. And you're gonna need three C batteries. In my case, I'm using Energizer. Uh, these are C sized. It comes with four screws, two little deals to attach this apparatus to the wall. This is a little glue strip to attach the button, which you can also use screws. And then we have some screws and some attachment pieces here. And one other thing I want to mention is this little piece right here. That's not a little piece of trash, no. That's to get a different sound on your doorbell. So it has two different sounds, sounds and we'll look at both of those in this video. I'm also going to have a hammer here and a screw here to pop a hole through the wall to get these started. Let's see how we do all this. All I'm doing right now is taking this thing. This piece opens in the back. Okay. And this little button has a little tab, which you'll pull that tab off. And this piece, you put a screwdriver in this back end right here, and it pops open, which I've already put a screwdriver in there and popped that open. Okay. Take that tab out, which there's a battery in there. Now I can push that battery in. And then if you want to, here's the sound, the button. And then here's that little black device. I'm gonna put that in this little piece right here. I like the other sound better. So I'm going to take it out. Okay. I like that better. So I'm going to close this back. Now I'm going to take this and I'm going to take my hammer and I'm going to get a hole pre-drilled for these little plastic pieces. Okay, now that I found a central location inside my house, this is the very center of my house and I can hear it very good from all places inside the house. I like this. I'm gonna take my screw, and you can see on the back there's two holes. I'm gonna place my screw right about where that hole is gonna go. And there's already some uh, areas inside the wall right here where there's some holes, so I'm just gonna go ahead and cover all that. And I'm gonna put it right there, okay? So I'm basically gonna stick the screw in the wall, and then I'm gonna do this, okay? I made a hole in the wall. I'm taking this little plastic piece right here and I'm gonna hammer it into that hole. Do it gently. Okay, we have one right here. Now that we have one right here, that's gonna be the one on this side over here. Now we need a hole for this side, okay? So all I'm gonna do is line it up perfectly like this. There's gonna be one right here. Okay, stick that in the wall. Okay, now I have both of those. What we're gonna do now is start these screws inside those. Just like this. One there. Okay, now I have this apparatus hung on the wall with just those two screws and those little plastic pieces, a hammer and a little nail that we used. That's all we did there. Now that can be heard anywhere from inside the house, over here, here, over there, and the button's gonna be right over here. 
So let's go place that button. All I'm doing now is taking this double-sided tape off. I'm sticking one portion to the back of the button. Okay, and then I'm peeling the other half off and we're gonna apply it to the wall. Okay. You tell me if you can hear it or not. 